let's learn the online document sharing program scribed in five minutes or less okay and this is the scribed homepage and this is at scribd.com and uh, this is a very powerful document sharing program and it's truly social media uh, as you can see over here you can log in using your Facebook uh, handle if you want to do that uh, once you are signed up if you choose to sign up uh, you can uh, use a variety of ways to share documents, but what's really cool when you get to the home page, let's say you just want to find some documents. Maybe I am a science teacher and I am going to teach something about the solar system. I can come in described and I just search solar system and I'm going to come down and I'm, I'm going to see all kinds of stuff on the solar system. Uh, here's something here. Uh, California Energy Commission, uh, maybe I'm not interested in that, air ventilation, uh, it, here's something that looks like it might come from a book, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click into that, and I, I can just scroll through this if I want, take a look at it, it might be something useful if I'm a social studies teacher that I might be able to share with my students. I can put it on a whiteboard, I can link it to my blog or website, uh, I can get students here and, and this is a great thing to use. Also, you'll notice that uh, you can comment uh, more from this user, so if I like the person who created this and, and he or she has uploaded more documents, I can find those as well. Uh, there are related documents. I mean, there's just a, a wealth of information here, and it's similar to some other things like maybe YouTube where you find a video and you find related things and you can subscribe. But these are documents, and a lot of times they're educational, and a lot of times they're very helpful. Let's say you would like to add a document to Scribd that you want to share with students or parents. Now keep in mind, I am not logged in, I'm not signed up, I'm going to come right in and I'm going to say I want to upload a document. I've got something that I want to share. Uh, and look at these options. I can upload from my computer. Uh, if I have something on Google Docs and I'd like to put it on Scribd, I can just click Google Docs, go in there and get that. If I have something that I feel like I could maybe sell, maybe I've written a, an ebook, I could come in here and I could do that. Uh, also, maybe I have typed something into a Word document or on a web page and I would like to create the document here. Uh, I've grabbed some text, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. So let's say uh, I'm a language arts teacher, so I have created some information on the novel The Giver, which we read, and now I'm just going to click Submit. And look at this. We need your email to finish uploading. That's no problem. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and click into an email, one of my many, and uh, click Send. Uh, and other options, sign in, uh, I have a, an account, uh, I don't, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to uh, get started this way. And as you can see, once that uh, signs me in, that I now uh, have an account and I have my document, which is right here. Now it's untitled, but I can go ahead and click on it and I can do some things to it uh, if I want to. Uh, I could download it. Maybe if I'm a viewer and I want to put it on my computer, I can do that. Uh, once again, uh, I, I can share it in a lot of ways if I want to. I can use some of these down here if I want to add it to my Twitter account. I would just click in there, click Readcast This, and it'll automatically upload it to those things. Uh, maybe I want to send this to a phone. Look at how nice this is from Scribd. I click on that. I choose the phone of my choice, and uh, I click into there, type in my cell number, and it'll send it to my device. So this is Scribd. Uh, truly Web 2.0, a uh, solid social media platform where you can share documents of just about any kind, show them to your class, show them to parents, search for documents that maybe you can use in class, and uh, I think there's a lot you can do with Scribd. That's Scribd in five minutes or less.